Before we move on to how linear equations are plotted on the coordinate plane, let's quickly review what linear equations in two variables are. We've seen equations like 2x plus 5y equals 12 or x minus y equals 4 and so on. These are examples of linear equations in two variables. Each of the equations has two variables x and y. But how do we generalize it? How can we define it? We can say that a linear equation in two variables is of the form ax plus by equals c or sometimes it's also written as ax plus by plus c equals zero. Both are correct. For example, the first equation can also be written as 2x plus 5y minus 12 equals zero. For this video and the future ones in this topic, we will assume the second one to be the general equation for linear equations in two variables. ax plus by plus c equals zero. a, b and c are constants, while x and y are variables. a is the coefficient of x and b is the coefficient of y. This is the general form we will consider. Hold on, are there any conditions here? Yes, first the constants a, b and c have to be real numbers and the second condition is interesting and I want you to listen to it carefully. Both a and b cannot be zero together. Yes, it means at least one has to be non-zero. Can you come up with a mathematical way to write the second condition? It's interesting and a very innovative way to write it. It can be written as a squared plus b squared will not equal zero. This will imply that both cannot be zero together. Because if both are zero, then the left hand side will equal zero. Now let's just consider the first equation we saw. 2x plus 5y equals 12. What is the solution to this equation? The solution to a linear equation in two variables is a pair of values. One for x and the other for y which makes both the sides of the equation equal. Can you think of x and y values here which will equate both the sides? One possibility is when x is 1 and y is 2. So we can say that x equals 1 and y equals 2 is one of the solutions to the equation 2x plus 5y equals 12. Can you tell me if x equals 3 and y equals 1 is the solution to this equation? The answer is no. If we substitute these values on the left hand side, we get a value of 11 which is not equal to 12. So this pair of values is not a solution to this equation. Now that we have a basic idea about linear equations in two variables, we can move on to looking at pairs of linear equations in two variables.